At the end of our blogs, we try to imagine what we could do to help in South Sudan. What do you think kids our age can do to help kids in other parts of the world like South Sudan? I don't know what you guys can do, but I know you guys have power. You have a good heart. Um, you can change the life of other kids in South Sudan. I was in, um, in New Jersey in 2008. The middle school called Robert, Robert, Robert King, something like that. Many of them, and they, they, you know, did uh, they did fundraising. They raised twenty three thousand dollars to support the clinic. Um, so that helped a lot, and it, it's, it's one way of helping. Other way of helping: spread the word through your blog, through the the information you send out to people. You know, talk to your mom, dad, talk to your teachers. You know, spread the word. I think that's really, really also uh, a very important way of, of, of supporting other kids. Because right now in Duke County, we have many children who are very malnourished, have no food, enough food to eat. So what we do, we have, we, we, we build a, uh, a nutrition center. We buy food. And then when they come very malnourished, for if you go to our website, you will see that there, there's a g little girl now uh, with uh, helping and it's getting better. It's getting, uh, putting more weight now. It's simply that. It's just have nothing to eat. So it's a ways that you can help as well, the other kid, so that they can become healthy. And then uh, it's, it's, I think it's a really better way to, to, to help. Music is very important in South Sudan. What is the song that kids our age know in South Sudan? <laughs> I don't know what s songs they know. But, uh, well, they know many Dinga songs and so on. But also other English songs. They, they normally they sing two songs. I think there's one say. Yeah, they say Sudan, our country, Sudan, our country, Sudan, our country, we all, we all forever. Sudan, our country, Sudan, our country, Sudan, our country, we all, we all forever. I love that because we all, all of us belong to South Sudan. And then others we also sing a song of, uh, you know, say, um, you know, uh, you know, uh, they said uh, uh, I forgot. Anyway, but they have they have other uh, you know other songs also in their different languages that they sing. Uh, uh, you know, so th those are good. Like uh, they, they sing other like European songs uh, that. Uh, uh, Please, boy, be the drum. We are, we are all very glad. Please be the drum. Well, we are all very glad. Please, boy, be the drum. We are, we are, Mashangala. We, please, boy, be the drum. We are all very glad to see, to, to please be the drum. Well, we are all very glad. Please, boy, be the drum. We are, we are Mashangla. I think that song comes from UK or somewhere else, but uh, they, they, they sing those songs. For our last question, you talked about your goodbye meetings after the last set of eye surgeries in Duke County. What are those? The goodbye meetings. What we did is, to give you just a little information, so we brought blind people from different tribes, from Murle tribe, from Lonwe tribe, from Gawe, from Dinga tribe, and then our doctors operate on them together. That was my idea of saying the way to bring peace is to also give something to people, create something as a peace dividend. And we did that very well. So we call people to sit all these patients before we take them home. We tell them the reasons why we're doing this is because we want to help you stop killing each other. 
is peace. If you stop killing each other, we will come to your village and we operate on you. We operate on your eyes so that you can see again. You know, uh, this is for peace. We don't want you to pay anything. If the only payment we need from you is to stop killing each other, stop killing one another, you know, don't kill kill other members of or go and raid members of other tribe or abduct children from other tribe. Please stop that. That's the only payment we need. So that's what we've been telling them, and we tell them, go home. You are messengers of peace. Talk to your people. Get, let people understand uh, what we are doing. If you stop killing each other, if you stop killing one another, we're gonna come tomorrow. We're gonna come next year. We're gonna, you will all, we'll always come and help you. That's what we need. And if you start coming back, go to raid other people home, other people cows, then you will, you know, you go, you're gonna go blind again, you know. So we try giving them that warning. So it was a nice goodbye meeting. After that, we asked all of them to greet each other, to hug each other in many languages. In Dinka, we say, uh, uh, you know, you, you could say loyedi or uh, you know shiruan, or other in in Murule you say abona. Or in Nuer you say male. So or in Anyuag you say derijut. So we give them these greetings uh, word from each tribe. And then they use greet each other, they say male, loedi, uh derijut and abonarot, all of this. So it was good. It was very good for you to see. I mean you will one day see that video. It was just wonderful. And you know, we now we took them back to their places and it went very well. John, you have opened up our eyes. What should we, rem what should we remember before we leave our meeting with you? What should, rem what should you guys remember really is that you have a power. Each of you here have a power. Sometimes we say, uh, well it's me, I am, I am, I am young and I am one. I can't do anything. You no, know, you can do anything. You are power. What drive you to bring you here? I'm not talking about a car, but that what is in your heart to drive you to come here. You leave dad, mom, come that far away from California to Colorado. What that drive you? It's a power that I'm talking about. Please use that power. Make sure you know that if you work hard, you're gonna serve other people's lives somewhere else in the world. If you don't do it, know that is your responsibility. It's now your responsibility. As young as you are, you could still change life so much. So I want you to remember that. What I want you to also remember is that what, whenever you're doing anything, you're gonna be faced with a difficult thing. You might not get this the way you want it. There might be setback. Please don't give up. If you give up, you just fail. Those who succeed are those who persist. They, they resist attempts of giving up. They kept going. So, so you guys, I appreciate you coming, six of you. And please tell the others, who might have not got the chance to come here, power belong to them. Don't look for someone else. Don't look for Muhammad Gandhi to come and help you. Don't look for, you know, somebody like Mandela to come and give you, give, give you direction or Lincoln or whoever, or your mom or your dad, or your teachers, those who are your heroes. Don't just wait for them, keep going. You can change life in United States. You can change your own life. You can change your neighborhood life. You can change other people's life around the world. Even children from Duke County. So we have something for you. Oh, I forgot those people. <laughs> thank you so much. Oh, thank you, thank you. <laughs> so we have 
You have given us so much through Duke County and God grew tired of us. So this is a bracelet or headband or I just don't wear a headband, but whatever you want to use it for in it. Um, we want to give you something back and we really feel connected to you. So we wanted to give you this. Wonderful. That is, that is wonderful. That we, um, with our school, whenever we make, whenever we, um, what we did is went, we went on a school trip and we, um, if we made a connection with someone, we would give them one of these headbands just to thank them for connecting with us. Wonderful. Let me tie in my head. Hold on. <laughs> headband. <laughs> <laughs> Matches your shirt. Yeah. <laughs> Wonderful. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Miss. Thank you so very much. I I appreciate that headband and uh, and then that's what I've been telling people. Give is what you think is important. You know, it's not what I think is important. What what you're giving me is a gift. So that's great. I share my my uh, my children. Give it to them. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. God bless. Thank you very much. Thank you guys. Thank you. God bless you. Thank you very much. Thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Thank you. So much. Great. Great. Thank you. That's our time. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah.